Imagine by Stephanie Yonakovsky Hardley. We're in an underwater chamber. How do fish encounter us? Stood still, they observe we aren't swimming. It's damp, smells like the river, eutrophic, earthy, and fishy. Pressure held, we breathe, without struggle, without gills. Around us, the river seeks to come in, join in the underwater world. We're feeling alien, sturgeon returned to the river Severn. Prehistoric wonders and modern mystery. They cruise waters not taking notice of us. Humans, we never swam with dinosaurs. Return to the chamber. Concrete, a view in. The low, murky surface to fish passing. Silent. Will we feel calm under pressure? Cautious. We imagine things differently. Size, materials, quality of light. But silence. Silence we agree on. Until the river's on. Through a speaker that fills us with water. Gurgles fill the dry silence. Flowing freely beyond our ears or gaze. Moving in stream. Now below water, anything can emerge from the depths. Reminiscent of snorkeling, floating leaves drift by the windows. It's rather gloomy, like an empty theater until words fill, float around the space. We're surrounded. Turbid, tan in colors. Was it a sea lamprey? We ask, intrigued. Like dreams remembered, fragments of life. We peep through a keyhole to their journey. We surface. Some wanted to stay. Fish is walking, our memories top up, saturated by raindrops. Curtains draw. In shadow and soft light, the window, the portal to another way of living. Where dancing fish lead with careful steps, we respect. <laughs>